What I'm going to do is show you how to connect your EV3 brick to your iPad. And the way we do that is first of all, you need to turn your brick on by pushing the middle button and the brick will go red and go through the uh, startup procedure. It takes about 30 seconds to start up. Um, if you're having problems, have your instructor help you check the battery. Uh, the batteries can sometimes go in poorly with these and that can be a big problem. So you're set right now. As soon as this comes on in a few more seconds, you'll hear a cool little noise. There you go, green light and it's good to go. So the first thing I need to do is I need to check to see if Bluetooth is on on this. I know it's kind of hard. I'm going to push the right, sorry, I know it's hard for you to see. I'm going to push the right um, arrow three times, and then the menu listed there has Bluetooth as the middle option, and you'll notice on yours, if not on mine, there is a blank checkbox next to Bluetooth. So I'm going to go down to Bluetooth. I have to choose it by hitting the middle button, and then I have to go up and make sure that all the empty boxes are checked off. If they're not checked off, Bluetooth won't work. All three boxes need to be checked off. And then to enter those settings, I'm going to hit the major check uh, checkbox right at the bottom there. And now Bluetooth is activated on my brick. So now what I want to do is I want to connect to it. I'm going to hit settings on my iPad. On the left-hand side, underneath airplane and Wi-Fi, I'm looking for the word Bluetooth. It is currently off. I will turn it on. And it's searching under other devices. It's searching for this brick now. This brick was named Camcardo. I don't know who, how, when, where, or why, and I don't care. I can always rename it myself. I'm going to click Camcardo. And now on the brick itself, it's asking me if I want to connect. And I'm going to go ahead and click the check mark. And then it's asking me for a pass key. It defaults to 1234. And that is the pass key that I'm going to choose. I'm not going to change it or do anything different. And then on the iPad, it asks, what are you using? One, two, three, four. Boom. And now you see it says connected. I am good to go. To get started, I'm going to find the Lego education software. It's down on my dock at the bottom there. If you have not uh, downloaded this from self-service, go ahead and do that before you go any further. Here we go, I've got my brick, and what I'm going to do, first of all, that's not it. Hey, you know, it has been over a year, and I forget how to rename my brick from the program. I'm gonna do that later. Maybe you can figure it out <laughs> like I couldn't. I'm going to hit new program, and here's the programming environment that we're going to use. And right there it says it's not connected, even though I know I connected it a second ago. So if you get that X in the top corner of your program, you want to use it and connect again. There we go. Now I'm connected. All right, in the next video, I will show you how to start programming. Thank you.